Live from Center City, this is Good Day Philadelphia. All right, Steve, there's a lot going on here. And in fact, a lot of times we talk about how these guys fight fires. But today at the Lingahawken Fire Department, we're going to learn how these guys say you can prevent fires in your own home. So that's all coming up. But first, let's take a live picture in the Garden State, the 42 freeway. Seven on this Firehouse Friday morning. I'm at the Lingahawken Fire Department in Wycombe, Bucks County, and we are here with all the guys. And Phil is telling me, Phil, what's your favorite part of breakfast? Sausage. Sausage, not the pancakes. Nah, sausage. George spent so long on these pancakes, and <laughs> Phil is going to be like, "No, the sausage is my favorite." But we got our Dunkin' Donuts coffee and donuts. We got all the goods here. And coming up a little bit later on, we're going to tell you about why these guys are telling you get sprinklers in your house, get sprinklers in your office. We are going to show you a really cool demonstration of how quickly sprinklers can save your life. It is really important, really educational. So stay tuned for that. But let's get you out the door. Show you what's happening on 95 this time. Anyway, you guys can handle the fun there. Me, Dave, Vinny, you know what we're going to do after the break? We are going to save lives. They say this sprinkler demonstration trailer will completely save your house from going up in flames. I will tell you how long it takes when Good Day Philadelphia continues. Couple minutes before eight o'clock. Welcome back to Firehouse Friday here at the Li at the Lycombe at the Lingahawken Fire Department in Wycombe, Bucks County, and I'm here at the fire demonstration trailer. Vinny, go ahead, hit it. Here we go. And we started the timer, and they tell me it's going to take less than a minute from when the fire gets started for the sprinklers to go off and for your life to be saved. They tell me if your smoke alarm goes off in your house, that means you need sprinklers. They told me stories about two different fires. One happened in Warwick. One happened in Doyle's town same situation one of the women unfortunately passed away in the fire the other woman was saved because of the sprinklers in her in her house so it is totally important so they're here to demonstrate just how quickly the sprinkler can save your life Vinny are you having some problems here no. oh no he said everything is cool we're lit he shut the door and you'll see how quickly the curtain goes up in flames and the room will be smoking and it will you'll see get scary real quickly they told me for insurance reasons I couldn't sit in the chair and sit in the room otherwise I would demonstrate just how scary it is but you'll be able to tell how fast the smoke gets going let's take a look at traffic and then we'll come back to the smoky room I'll show you what's happening on the blue route over by the concha well we'll come back here live to firehouse Friday and you can see here in in Wycombe, we're at the New Jersey Fire Sprinkler Advisory Board. It's their demonstration trailer, and it is up in smoke here. And it is definitely a frightening scene, as you can see. And we'll show you just how long it takes for the sprinklers to put out the fire. And really, it only takes a little under a minute here, and you'll be able to see how quickly the curtain is just about smoked out. And Vinny's looking at it, and I can tell he was like, when are the sprinklers going off? And there it is. So your life would have just been saved if you were here. We'll bring you back and show you more of this coming up a little bit later on. Chanel? Be wet but alive. Good stuff there. Thank you, Jamie. 757 now. All right, let's send it back out to Jamie Shupak, who was showing us some interesting things this morning from the firehouse. Jamie? Yes, absolutely. You saw before just how quickly a sprinkler could save your life. Now we're going to go to the next step. How do you get a sprinkler for your home? And what I'm learning here is that you can get a sprinkler in 800 different colors. In case you're concerned about it matching your decor or sticking out or anything like that, not to worry because it is so easy to do and there are so many colors. I'm here with Ray from the Sprinkler Advisory Board. He was just showing me on the internet just how easy it is. What is the website again? It's the NFS National Fire Sprinkler Association website. It's www.nfsa.org. Uh, on the menu column on the left, click on Members. And from there, on a the drop-down menu, you'll see, you'll see the commercial and residential sprinkler drop-down menu for Pennsylvania. Just hit search, and it'll come up with the members that install residential sprinkler systems. That is so easy. We're going to put a link to that on our website so you can do it, too. In the meantime, we're going to get you out the door, show you what's happening over on the Vine Street Expressway and over by I-95.